you have that typical bourbon th smell. Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. Today we have the hmm, Valentin Special Reserve on the cask and it's a bit critical because uh, the bottle's green, the picture for me it's green, <laughs> it's a green screen, um, so a bit, bit of a difficult situation. Okay, so um, we have the Blenton Special Reserve. It's a single barrel whiskey from the Buffalo Trace Distillery in, I think that's Frankfurt? Yeah, Frankfurt, Kentucky. So it's a, a typical bourbon. Um, so we can assume a few things if it's a typical bourbon. We can assume it's uh, more than 40%. It actually has, I think, exact 40%, 80 proof. Um, we can assume it has no coloring and it was matured in American white oak. So um, the Buffalo Trace Distillery, I had a chat with them. I also, there's a video about Buffalo Trace. I think you also see the, the, bear, uh, the bottling of the single, um, of the Blanton's brand. Not sure if it's a single barrel they bottled just then when I took the video. Um, but um, the Buffalo Trace Distillery usually has a mash bill of 90% corn and uh, rest is, I think, barley, maybe a bit of rye in there. But they have different mash bills at uh, the Buffalo Trace Distillery, so we can't know for sure that it's a 90% corn whiskey. Um, yeah. There is a nice story, I can, I can show you the bottle. And every, every bottle has uh, numbers on them. And it is even more numbers written in pen on here, but you know, I got the faulty one. We can't sell this, so we better may try it. So yeah, and there is a story about this, uh, this horse up there. It's also in the distillery video. And the horse has little, uh, little letters down here and they are all letters um, that contain uh, that are contained in the word blend. So we have B L A T uh, N T O N twice and S. So um, and the the little rider here for the horse riding is uh, resembles the horse riding that is a very very popular sport in uh, Kentucky. So Kentucky is all about whiskey and horse riding, um, and he resembles the race. I've explained this in the video as well. So yeah, but today it's uh, about trying the whiskey and it's made with a, oh, maybe I can show you. Take them here and it even says pull. Take it right off, a bit messy. And the cork is really nice so you can see here I got the, the rider and maybe you can see it here is a little O. You always have to have to put the things in front of your face so the camera doesn't detect your face and focus on the face. Bottles also look really nice in the, in the, the cupboards so if you're really a big fan of Blanton's and then keep the corks or the bottles as a whole, put them all in a, in a line and, you, and then you can spell out Blanton's with the different stages of the race. Mm. You have that typical bourbon th smell, but it's combined with a, a little citric smell. Even a little grapefruit, so. Rather fresh for a bourbon. Don't have much caramel. You get a sweetness, but it's more of a, a vanilla honey one. Mm. Really nice. Mm. 
caramel vanilla so the caramel is there you just don't smell it again a, a slight touch of a smoky bonfire note very slight mm, and now as it develops you get a bit of a, a citric note mm. and that even brings the whole whole thing down if, if you eat a, a, a lemon citrus lemon then and then you you know the the acidity brings everything together in the mouth and you go like mm. yeah that's how it a bit feels like mm. Mm. a little bitterness and spiciness is also included just in the back of your mouth when you when you swallow, swallow it. Mmm. Oh yeah. It's a bit. It's a bit hefty for for just forty uh, percent ABV. If if I would have guessed, I would have put it at forty six percent ABV or forty three. Mmm. So get a bit more uh, of a stronger character for for bourbon so I can't really believe that it's 90% corn so uh, my estimation would be that there is a bit of rye in there um, maybe maybe it's just the climate so yeah thanks for watching if you find this interesting then please feel free to share this video with your friends and if you'd like to know more about uh, the buffalo trace distillery or any, any other distillery then please feel free to visit whiskey.com we have a vast majority of um, distilleries in our collection and if you we ha don't have the distillery we are, you're looking for then just drop us an email and we will add it to our base and do a little research to find out what this distillery is about so thanks for watching